What started as a dad wanting to give his son an opportunity has turned into so much more. It is called Special Hockey in Michigan. It's held every Saturday afternoon at the St. Clair Shore Civic Center. Here's our Jamie Edmonds with the story behind the Michigan Flyers. Nice pass. If it's a Saturday in the fall or the winter, Frank Taylor is at the St. Clair Shore Civic Center. He's a hockey dad and he's a head coach. I have a special needs son that uh, his, his older brothers played hockey at a, a through a college level and one actually played pro hockey. And uh, my, my disabled son was always at the hockey rinks and he wanted to skate too. Taylor wanted to provide an avenue for his son Trevor to play the game the whole family loved. And so the Michigan Flyers were born. For two decades now, the Flyers have been dedicated to the development and enjoyment of hockey for the developmentally or physically challenged athletes. Any child with a disability is welcome to come out, see our program, and hopefully join our program. We're trying to grow the program. Uh, over the years, we've, we've been able to keep about 30 to 40 people in the program. 20-year-old Anthony Maniacci has been on the team for four years. They like knew that I loved hockey and all that, and they, they, they knew that I was a pretty good at this sport, and they just picked me to be on this team. Maniacci has the confidence for sure, but when it comes to the leading scorer on the team, that's up for debate. He scores more most goals than I do sometimes. <laughs> well, you do. Yeah, you do. 20-year-old Kevin Holloway patrols the blue line for the Flyers. It's a fun team to play on with all friends and uh, all teammates. The Flyers practice every Saturday from 3 to 4.30 in St. Clair Shores. They scrimmage each other and they scrimmage other area hockey teams around Metro Detroit. But today was unique. Today was a home game against another special needs team from Grand Rapids, the West Michigan Patriots. While there were some nice plays and some great saves, the final score not as important as the feeling of trying and trying again and eventually succeeding in sport. Yeah! Making hockey accessible to boys and girls of all ages and disabilities, which was Frank Taylor's dream all those years ago. I love him. He's the best coach. He's awesome. This was a home and home series with the Patriots. The Flyers play them at their home rink on the west side of the state in mid-March. Now the season might be coming to an end, but the Flyers are always looking for new players. We'll put their contact information on clickondetroit.com. Jamie Edmonds, Local 4. How sweet. And then it's grown into all these other teams too. Exactly. Really great movement. Great.